In our status bar project here, we're going to look at the information bar. And in its elements.xml, we can again see the command UI definition. And we're in the ribbon.library.share location. And in the controls, we're going to add a new button. And the button that we're going to add, we're going to give it the ID contoso.ribbon.library.statusbar button. Right, so we're basically going to place um, a button so that when we press the button, we're going to execute the contoso.statusbar message code. And in the command UI handler that handles this command UI definition, we're going to have the command contoso.statusbar message, which matches up with the command that our button executes up here. And all we're doing here is using the JavaScript version of the SharePoint client side object model and using sp.ui.status and adding a status message. And the status message is going to be information colon. That'll be our title. And then please add a descriptive comment to all check ins. And then we set the color of the status message to yellow. So now if we deploy this solution, build and deploy status bar message, we'll deploy that to our team.contoso.com site. And once that deployment is complete, we'll refresh the site. And then we'll go into uh, the document library. And in the share and track group, we should see our new display status message. All right, our deploy succeeded. So now we can go to our team.contoso.com site. If we go to our document library and go to the library tab, we now have in our share and track group display status message. And if we click on display status message, we get our yellow status message. So that's how we add a status to SharePoint 2013.